Hello everyone, so we're going to continue with our 1000 Kiswahili words or Swahili words. And um, we have already covered uh, the basic words that you can use, use uh, that are starting with A. So without wasting your time, right now we're going to continue with the ones that starts with B. Okay, so the very first one that I'm starting with is Baada. 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 Baada actually is simple. It means after. So if you say after lunch, that will be Baada ya chakula chamchana. Now, lunch. In Swahili is chakula chamchana and um, there is one thing also uh, for example if you want to say afternoon as you can see they are related so it will be mchana 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 that will be afternoon now um, I will also add another word here so after afternoon is evening. So evening in Kiswahili is Gioni 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 Now but um there's one word that is very close to Baada which is Badae 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 actually can be directly translated to English as then or later and it can also be afterwards so if you want to say uh, see you later you can say or if you want to say let's meet later in Swahili will be tuonane baadae Okay, so that's it about Baada and Baadae. Now we're going to see one very interesting word, which is Baadi. Baadi. Baadi is actually very simple. It's some, some of, some of the people will be Baadi Yawatu. We have already seen this. Ya means off. So some of the people will be Baadi Yawatu. Some of the products will be Baadi Ya Bida. Uh, the next one will be very simple word because it's uh, it occurs in many languages. This will be Baba. Baba is as you guessed, it's father, dad. So Baba is father or dad. Okay, so I won't talk much about this. Now we're going to see another one which is very interesting also, and it's Babaika. Babaika. Babaika actually means um, be confused or maybe not really making clear. Uh, clear the, not really making something clear so I, for example if I say oh I don't know oh, this I don't know that that oh, I don't know what I want to say uh, in Swahili we just say uh, una babaika una you remember u means you na now you are doing this thing so una means you are doing something right now. So una babaika means um, you are confused right now. You are not, you are not making any 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 anything clear. All right. Okay. Next also will be very easy because it's also used in many languages. Babu. 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 So babu means actually grandfather grandpa all right so i won't talk much about it babu yangu means my grandpa
it means it shows possession possession so yangu is mine so babu yangu my grandfather okay now we're going to check the next one which is badili badili actually means change okay change change something in swahili will be badilisha kitu something in swahili is kitu so badili kitu it will be change something all right mm, we are also going to see a very 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 interesting word that you will hear much 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 in kiswahili language okay this will be bado bado in swahili actually means not yet so if somebody ask you uh are you ready you can also say bado are you ready in swahili is upo tayari upo tayari so if somebody ask you upo tayari if you're not ready you will say bado and if you're ready you will answer nipo tayari nipo tayari which means nipo means i am okay all right so nipo tayari means i am ready okay well now let's see the next word will be bahari now bahari actually means bahari means sea or ocean so uh bahari ya hindi bahari ya hindi bahari ya hindi in english is indian ocean indian ocean okay this one is easy to to understand and then now so for those people who sail in who sails over the sea and they go everywhere by sea we call them baharia it only means one person and then if we want to say there are many of them we just add ma baharia okay so sailors or seamen are ma baharia while a sailor just one or a seaman will be baharia okay now we're going to to see another one which is a bonus for today and that will be bahati 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 is is luck or fortune if you are lucky i will say una bahati una means you have and uh, lucky which means you have lucky uh, which in english the best way to say is you are lucky but in kiswahili we say una bahati which translates directly to you have lucky uh, you have luck so that's it for today i will see you on the next one